What's up everyone? Welcome back to guns.com. My name is Seth Rogers and this is Bucking Out where we talk about all things deer hunting. Today's the day. Uh, hopefully the training that I've been doing with Kristen for the past few weeks will pay off and I finally get some deer on the ground. Uh, like I said, this is my first time deer hunting. So I'm really excited to get out there with Kristen and, and see what I can do and, and hopefully get a deer, hopefully a buck on the ground. Um, so nobody told me that we had to wake up at the crack of dawn to do this as you can see not light out no one's really moving around right now but that's part of deer camp i guess so come with me let's go get some deer driving to deer camp there is a profound stillness and tranquility in the air it's cold outside barely breaking 20 degrees i see a few deer moving about in the morning on my 20 minute drive to the camp I'm mixed with nervous energy and heightened anticipation for my first hunt, slamming energy drinks and coffee to make up for the subpar sleep I got on my cheap motel mattress. When I arrive to the camp, it's still dark outside, and as we walk to the stand, it remains dark. I'm reminded of what Kristen told me earlier in the week. We're going to sit in the stand from dawn until dusk, no breaks. As the sun rises over the trees, there is an otherworldly silence and stillness in the air. It's a welcome departure from the 20 to 40 mile per hour wind gusts that we trained in. The air is so quiet that we can hear deer crunching leaves under their hooves as they walk through the field. Immediately in the morning we spot a young four point buck. I line up my sights on him and could take him. While it's tempting to get a deer on the ground right away, we ultimately decide it's best to pass and let him live another day. Well, we made it out to the deer stand here. Uh... Kristen, we saw some deer this morning. We did. We had two little bucks actually out, a couple of does. Beautiful sunrise. Absolutely. Decided to pass on the four pointer that we saw because we're going, for a bigger going for a little bit bigger. We only get one buck, so. We hope we don't eat our decision. <laughs> I think we'll see more deer. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna keep waiting here. Um, hopefully soon. Get that big buck on the ground. We'll see. Alright guys, we got a big buck. Going for it. God. <laughs> I'm guessing that's at least a 10 pointer. <laughs> you did fantastic. <laughs> so proud of you. Wow. That is <laughs> exhilarating. Wow. That is awesome. Let's go check it out, I guess, right? Let's just give him a second. Yeah. Just... Whew. Sit down. Let your heart slow down. <laughs> I'm excited for you. Yeah, I'm shaking. You spotted it, you did the whole thing. I really thought he was just gonna ball into the woods. You did awesome. <sighs> All right, we gotta get a video right now. Just pulled the trigger on a monster buck that came across a field. What's going through your mind right now? Uh, it's kind of, uh, it's, uh, the feeling is kind of indescribable at this point. Um, I don't even know how big, the, I know it's a big buck. 
I know it's a big buck. It's a huge body and a huge rack. It, it's a it's a big buck. Um, I, he was running good. He stopped for just a little bit, and um, I saw the shot, so I took it. Um, it's it's gonna become more real, I think, once I get next to him. Yeah, and awesome. and um, I'm excited to see <laughs> what the rack looks like on this guy, but. Uh, Satisfying to see all the work finally pay off, and so. And you passed on a couple small ones this morning, which I think we were second guessing. So. Yeah, we we passed on a four pointer this morning, and uh, you know we spent you know the past three hours sitting here going, should have we passed on that one? And then all I right, saw this okay. big guy come in, and I got a clean shot on him. That seven millimeter really. Uh, you made a great shot. He went right down. Really did the job. He went right down. Yeah. So, um, so I, we I, just made sure he's expired and he's not going anywhere. So we're going to go down and check this out. I'm super pumped. <laughs> <You should be. laughs> I'm so excited for you. That's <laughs> freaking is awesome. Like a buck of a lifetime for a lot of people. Woo! Seriously. Yep, you're going to have to get a shoulder mount. <laughs> I put a new round in there. Yep. and just touch right next to his eye. Oh man, look at the brow tines on that. This is a huge buck. Get your hands on that rack. <laughs> Make sure you got your gun on safe. Oh my god. Holy I've shit. never seen one with brow tines like that. <laughs> I've never shot anything like that before. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen pointer. <laughs> you just beat me on your first. <laughs> this is a buck of a lifetime. Yeah. Yeah, thank you so much, Kristen. <laughs> I might have to get this one mounted, yeah. You absolutely do. I've never seen a brow tine like that that divides into three. That is humongous. And he's a fighter. There's a lot of times busted off there. Absolutely amazing. You want to get a grip and grin for me? I definitely do. <laughs> I guess the show bucking out uh, came to fruition here. Um, the feeling is, when does it, there's no words, there's no words right now for how I feel. Um, you know, we called the show bucking out kind of in jest. You know, I really came out here just to get a deer. And um, the fact that I got a huge deer that's gonna feed my family for a long time is awesome. But you know, the fact that it's also a trophy buck is like, I don't know. <laughs> there's there's no words to describe how I'm feeling right now, except um, so excited and so grateful for Kristen to allow me to come out here and, and do this. And you know, not a lot of people uh, get to see where their food comes from. And, this is a, an ex especially exciting moment for me, and, and um, I'm gonna use every single part of this buck that I can to feed me, myself, and my family. And just, like I said, words cannot describe how I feel right now. It's just an, an incredible moment. Um, like I said, I wanna thank Kristen for all the help she, she gave me for filming right now, and for, uh, <laughs> you know, obviously taking me on the range. And, the seven millimeter rem mag, it did the job. This this buck dropped right away. 
Well, Kristen, <laughs> I think this is well. a pretty good end to the, our bucking out series, huh? This is even better than we could have imagined. We shot a buck bigger than most of the ones I've gotten in 25, 30 years of hunting. So this is absolutely amazing. Sorry about that. <laughs> I'm not sorry at all. It's worth more to me to see a new hunter have this kind of success and do it so well. You made a perfect shot. The deer didn't take a step. And I mean, the gear is fantastic. Your Remington 700 Sierra ammunition in that game changer put that right down. Big, big shout out to Sierra. Um, I think you just hit it right on the head. Probably the thing that I'm happiest about most with this was that the deer dropped right away. It did, absolutely a great shot on your part. All that practice on the range paid off. And I say we're wearing true timber, which when we're in the stand doesn't make a big difference, but it kept us warm. We didn't have heat going this morning. It was 23 degrees. So we stayed out while everybody else headed in for breakfast. This is the result of putting in hours in the stand. This guy just charged right out and um, he didn't give us much time. No, that was that happened fast. But your uh, your little deer call made him stop. <laughs> and, uh, you know, I took the two seconds that he gave us. And um, thankfully, uh, well-placed shot. Sierra ammunition again just dropped it right in its tracks. And it, it I don't think it felt much pain at all. No, definitely not. This was as clean a kill as you can get. And this will feed your family. None of this deer will go to waste, and this is what the ethical hunt is all about, and you're going to have memories for a lifetime. Awesome. Well, I I thank you for the memories. I, you know, I'm so appreciative right now. I'm so grateful for what you've done for me here, and, um, And it was know. an honor for me to be here to share that with you for your first deer. Absolutely. Thank you so much. If you like this video, if you like this series of videos bucking out with me and Kristen, I think maybe next year we'll, we'll try it again, right? Yeah. Why not? Um, Subscribe to our channel, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and uh, we'll see you next time.